YouTube, welcome to my channel if you are new and today I have another video for you guys So right now I am headed to the gym. So I'm gonna be showing you guys a leg workout And yeah, and then I'm gonna show you guys a big Costco haul and then also a lot of women's best stuff because I just got my order in and Yeah, so I really hope you guys enjoy this lower body glute workout and I will talk to you guys after So I'm starting out with front squats. I've been absolutely loving doing front squats for my leg days. I feel the activation of my quads a lot more when I perform front squats as opposed to performing back squats. So I will usually start off with a lighter weight for warming up and then I'll work my way up to increasing the weight. So you want to rest the bar on top of your deltoid muscles and also across your arms. You want to lift the bar off the rack by pushing with your legs and also straightening your torso at the same time. You want to use a shoulder width stance with toes slightly pointed outwards and also keep a straight back. And then you want to start to lower your body by bending your knees and then you want to continue to bend down until the angle between your upper leg and your calves becomes slightly less than about 90 degrees. Then you want to start to raise the bar by straightening your legs and going back up into the starting position. Then I'm supersetting the front squats with resistance band pulses. So you want to place the resistance band right above your knee and then you want to squat down and pulse up and down. So this exercise is killer. It's a combination of a back squat going into a lunge. So you want to stand with your feet shoulder width apart, go down into a squat position and then come back up. Then you're going to proceed into a lunge by placing your right leg behind and like next to your left leg while keeping the left leg still. Then you're going to come up from the lunge by bringing your right leg back up into the shoulder width stand. And you're going to bring your left leg back into a lunge and come back into the shoulder width stand again and then proceed into the back squat. Next exercise is Smith Machine Step Ups. So you want to place some steppers in front of you. You're going to step up with one leg and push up with the leg on the stepper. And you want to make sure to push up from your heels in order to feel the activation in your glutes. Then you're going to superset with resistance band squat jumps. You're going to place the resistance band right above the knee and jump up and land in a squat position and then jump up from the squat position again. So this superset combination is absolutely killer. Like afterwards, I was just lying on the ground, like panting like a dog. <laughs> Thank you. 
Last superset is barbell walking side shuffles. You're going to place the barbell in a front squat position. I find doing a front squat position works a lot better. I find if you put the barbell in a back squat position, it's really uncomfortable because you're just constantly in a squat position and then the barbell just adds more pressure on your lower back. So you're gonna bend down into a squat position, you're gonna shuffle sideways and you wanna make sure to side shuffle the other way as well so that both legs are getting activated. Then you're gonna superset with closed stance resistance band squats. So the feet positioning for these are a little bit different. You wanna have your heels touching and toes pointed outwards. And the angle between your toes should be around 90 degrees. So this type of stance activates your quads so much. Guys, give this a try. And you can really feel the burn in your quadriceps with this type of stance. So just got back from the gym. Right now I'm gonna be attempting this Herbie chicken from HelloFresh. This looks so good. So I got all my veggies cut up. Ignore this. <laughs> and I got my farro, farro? I don't know how to pronounce this. But it says farro. Boiling, got my Herbie chicken on the pan, frying. So yeah, I'm excited to try this. I've never tried this kind of grain before, so that'll be really interesting. So this is the finished product. It looks so good. I'm so excited to try this. I already had a bit of the, like the tomato broccolini mixture and it tastes bomb. Also, if you guys are interested, I do have a 40% off code for your first box. Honestly, HelloFresh has introduced me to so many new recipes and this looks so good. I'm so excited to have this as my post-workout meal. Okay, so I just did a massive Costco trip run. So I'm gonna show you guys everything that I got. So I got these chicken drumsticks. I got three packs of those because I actually like the way these taste better than chicken breasts. And what I usually do is I'll peel off the skin. And then once you peel off the skin, each of these is about like 13 or like 15 grams of protein. So yeah, so these taste way better than chicken breasts. And then I got some chicken thighs, which I also peel off the skin. I got two packs of the uh, chicken breasts. I got a box of Cliff Bars. And then, this is like a going back to school haul. I got like a huge bag of bagels, bread, eggs, lettuce, bok choy, cucumbers, green onion, cilantro, broccoli, milk. Then I have apples, carrots, yams here. And then I also got more Greek yogurt from Costco. And then I got this Philadelphia cream cheese. Egg whites, of course. Greek dressing, this is like my favorite. And then I got two more like stacks of bread, like I usually freeze them. I got a whole ton of ground turkey, another bag of the frozen shrimp, and then I got two bags of frozen fruit. So I got uh, strawberries, and then I also got blueberries. And I got toilet paper, because you know, that's important for the washer. So yeah, that's my grocery haul. Also, I'm gonna show you guys some of the stuff that I got from Women's Best. So, I got this Fitway from Women's Best. So this is one of their new products. Um, and also I have a code for you guys. So it's just Lucy, and you'll get 10% off your entire order. So I got the flavor chocolate. So for most of you guys who watch me a lot, you guys already know that I use like this one, the all-in-one whey protein. So I'm gonna try this one out and see if it tastes like any different. So I got the all-in-one whey protein and banana. I got BCA amino acid and raspberry rush. And then I also got another one of these protein creams cause ugh, they just taste so good. And then I got also protein wafers, waffers. Then I also got two protein cookies as well as these uh, protein cookies and cream boxes. So I'm gonna try this out and let you guys know how those taste. So I'm about to have dinner. I'm gonna be making the Burberry chicken. I don't know how to pronounce it, but it is this recipe right here. 
looks super good. So it's like couscous, zucchini, and chicken. And yeah, so it's nice that it comes with like all the ingredients in the little bag. Yep. So this is what the finished product looks like. So we have the chicken and the zucchini and then also the couscous. So, so cool because I have never had couscous before. So this is my first time having it. I would not have ever tried it if HelloFresh didn't introduce it to me. So, yep. So that was it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed that workout, grocery haul, women's best haul, and a few clips of what I eat in a day. So yeah, I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye.